So worried you'll be uh, bored out of your mind when you're trapped inside this winter? Well, fear not. Now is the time to tackle some inside projects that will help you and your family get the most out of your indoors. And actually, I got some tips that'll help you and your family stay busy and entertained from a veteran remodeling contractor. Take a look. Just because the cold weather has started doesn't mean that you should stop maintaining and improving your home. There are many projects you can and should do as the winter approaches. Home improvement expert Danny Lifford joins us with a few ideas. Good morning, Danny. Hey, good morning, Tina. Glad to be with you. Absolutely. Now, you know what the first question is going to be. How, what can we do to be comfortable in our home? Do you know we don't want to spend a lot of money? Well, it is important to try to save as much money as you can because uh, that first heating bill is always a shock. But here's a few of the things that you can do. Great list from our friends at Carrier. First of all, have your heating system serviced. Very important for the efficiency and the safe operation of it. Also, it's not too late to seal any crack that you may have outside your home. Also, change that furnace filter on a regular basis. Really important for that indoor air quality. And consider a whole house ventilation system as well. Those are great for really purifying the air. And if your heating system is over 12 years old, you may need a new one. But the good news, if you get a new one, they're far more energy efficient than they were 10 or 12 years ago. I love that. We're going to try to save on those power bills. Now that we're inside and everything's nice and cozy, do you have some inside projects for us to do? Well, I'll tell you what, the buzzword these days is drop zone. So many people want to build a little organized area right inside their entry door so that the kids can drop off those backpacks and their little shoes and kind of keep things a little decluttered around the home. And my daughter Chelsea helped the homeowner here build an excellent looking um, drop zone, and she's going to show it off right now. That's right. This not only is it functional now, but it's certainly more attractive with the beadboard and the nice bench for the two kids that live here to take their shoes on and off. before. It was just an empty alcove that um, was underutilized and uninspired. So we got to work by cutting and sanding and priming all of our materials. And it, I really love the result. And it's certainly a lot more functional. And, and, and it looks nice, too. But it really all came together with the help of the Black & Decker tools that the homeowner has right out here in her garage, especially the matrix system, where you can take off an interchangeable head and attach any of these other attachments and different tools, depending on what project you're working on. And we uh, also had their jig saw and circular saw here but what I like the best is the auto sense that it detects when the screw is flush with the surface so you're not gonna uh, strip your wood or, or make it cause it to split. Well, I think this looks like some good Christmas presents for dad don't you think? Yeah I have them on my list to, for you to get me. Oh, for early, I'll tell you <laughs> like that Gina. <laughs> That's so great Chelsea I love that a little hint hint wink wink on the uh, under the tree <laughs> presents. That's great. Now that we got everything organized what about a little bit of spruce up for the holiday gatherings. Well, you know, so many people will be coming right up to your front door, so make sure your front door looks very welcoming. You know, if you can put a new coat of paint on that front door or maybe take the fixtures that you have on either side of the door and, you know, maybe paint those to make them look a lot better, but also better than anything, decluttering the house. And I'll tell you, a great place that you have at your house that you can hide a lot of that stuff is up in the attic. Now, most everybody has an attic stairway, but it's really dangerous carrying those heavy boxes up and down the stairway. We have a solution that we offer to this homeowner and it's called the Versa Lift. The Versa Lift is essentially like a dumb waiter for your attic and now you should never allow any kids or anybody to ride on this even though it has a capacity of 250 pounds but think about how convenient it is for someone to go up the stairs and load everything on here and to be able to bring them right down to where you can get it and then when the holidays are over or you want to move everything back in the attic you simply push the button again and it carries it right back into the attic. Attic. And we have some great shelving that we built up in the attic space for the homeowners so that they can conveniently just transfer this and store it like that. It really is uh, pretty cool. And I got some uh, great video and great information on all of this stuff, Tina, on our website at todayshomeowner.com. Well, we will definitely go check that out. That's some high tech stuff there for the attic. I think so. It's, it's a great way to go. So much safer. And like I say, you got a lot of space up there. You might as well utilize it. Might as well utilize it. Thank you, Danny. And so nice to meet you, Chelsea. Good to meet you. <laughs> Thanks for having us. Absolutely. The Morning Blend will be right back.